Okay, so on loan repayments, we are looking at an example of um, calculating the outstanding balance on a loan. And those, though these questions are quite simple, they are quite time consuming and you'll see in a moment just why. Okay, so Danny took out a loan of 450000 from the bank. He's paying, um, he's paying it, sorry, that should be it. He's paying it back. He is paying it back over 35 years with payments monthly and the bank is charging him interest at 13.5% per annum compounded monthly. What is the balance on his loan now if he has made payments for 31 years? Okay, so again, let's do our timeline. Here we go from 0 to 35 years. Okay. So here we have the years in between and we are here somewhere at 31. Okay. And what's important is that we make monthly payments, okay, every year. So put in as many uh, as much information as you can on this timeline, 30.5% per annum, okay? Uh, do we know what his amount is that he's paying back? Let's see. Do we know no we don't know what the amount is that he is paying back. Okay, so if we look at our formula, Pn is equal to x1 minus 1 plus i to the power negative n over i. Okay, we can see here that we know what the original value is. But we want to use this formula, the same formula, to find out what will the value be here. Okay, what will this value be at right here? And to do that, we are first going to need to calculate x. So that's going to be our first step, calculating the monthly amount that he has paid back. Okay, so we know that he took out a loan of 450000 Okay, so the present value is 450,000. We don't know what his repayment amount is. We know that the interest that is charged is 13.5%. Okay, but that amount must still be divided with 12 because he's making monthly payments. Okay, very important. He is making payments monthly. So we know there's 12 months in a year, so he's getting interest not at 13.5%, but at that divided by 12. And also divided by 100 because we're working in a percent there. Okay, so how many payments is there going to be in the total 35 years? So right at the beginning here, we are owing 450,000 Rand, okay, with how many payments left? So that's the question we should ask ourselves. N represents how many payments are left. And that's 35 times 12. And that is what? 7 times 6 is 420 payments. So in 420 payments left. Now let's go and calculate. So we have 450,000 is equal to X is unknown. 1 minus 1 plus 13.5 over 1200 to the power of negative 420. All of that divided by 